Welcome to our show, Future Trends. Today, Breakthrough in Physics, Particle Accelerator on a Microchip. Imagine being able to shrink one of the world's largest and most complex machines, the Particle Accelerator, down to the size of a fingertip. Sounds like science fiction, right? But that's precisely what researchers from Erlangen have achieved. Particle accelerators are incredible machines that propel charged particles to extremely high speeds. A well-known example is the Large Hadron Collider at CERN in Geneva, which accelerates protons to nearly the speed of light in a 27-kilometer long tunnel. But what if we could have all that on a tiny chip? Since 2013, two leading research groups, one from Stanford University and the other from Friedrich Alexander University in Erlangen, Nuremberg, have showcased prototypes of such miniature accelerators. And now, the Erlangen group has made a remarkable breakthrough. They've developed a particle accelerator that can boost the energy of electrons by an astounding 43% over just 500 micrometers. That's a record in terms of energy and acceleration. Another milestone of this research is the beam's focus. Typically, magnets are used to focus the electrons. But with such tiny dimensions, that's not straightforward. However, the Erlangen group has bypassed this issue using a technique called APF confinement, where the laser itself is used to focus the electrons. An exciting future goal? A particle accelerator on an endoscope to perform radiation therapy directly inside the body. While we're still far from this dream, this research shows it's possible, and the possibilities are endless. Interestingly, the Stanford group developed a similar mechanism almost simultaneously but achieved an energy gain of only 25%. So, it's an exciting race between the two teams. Now, I want to hear from you. Do you believe such microchip particle accelerators could become commonplace in the near future? What other applications can you envision for this technology? Which group do you think will make the next breakthrough, Stanford or Erlangen? Please leave your answers in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any exciting developments.